It was still dark. The sunrise had not yet occurred. As I was waiting on top of the gantry, I suddenly looked down and saw the lights of the media, and I realized that this was not just another Earth orbital flight, but actually we are all very serious about going to the moon. And I think it was the, the, the third orbit that um, actually, as we came around the moon, we saw the uh, Earth uh, rise from the lunar horizon. Oh, God, look at that picture over there. The Earth coming up. Wow, isn't that pretty? Get a color film, Jim? Hand me a roll of color quick. Oh, man, that's great. Where is it? Quick. The moment was uh, quite spectacular, and uh, we realized uh, the importance of taking that photograph. Yeah, I'm looking for one. C-368. Anything, quick. Hey, man, let me get the right thing. Okay, calm down, Jim. Yeah, I'm trying to get the right thing. Oh, I got a ray. Oh, that's a beautiful shot. I could put my thumb against the window of the command module. I could completely hide the Earth behind my thumb. That's how small it was. You sure you got it now? Yeah, we're getting up here. Come on. And I realized that everything I ever knew was behind my thumb. All the history of the planet that I've ever known and uh, my loved ones, everything was behind my thumb. And so it told me uh, two things. It told me, one, how insignificant we really all are on that small body. And also how fortunate we all are to be there. Instead of, you know, hopefully going to heaven when you die, is you actually go to heaven when you're born. You arrive on a planet of the proper mass that has the gravity to contain water in an atmosphere. In essence, really, uh, I think that God gave us a, a platform upon which to perform a stage. And, of course, uh, how that uh, project or play turns out is strictly up to us.